G'day Raw Apps fans and mobile app gaming fans, it's uh, Michael Raw from Raw Apps here again for another game review. Uh, today I'm going to be reviewing Helix Jump which has um, been out for quite a while now and I'll just double check to see how long it's been out. Anyway, probably a few months, three months maybe, It's um, or maybe more than that actually. It's number one top games, uh, top action game uh, on the Play Store and also um, I think number one in one of the categories on uh, the the App Store. So 100 million downloads, uh, it's huge, it's not a voodoo game. Of course they get you know millions and millions of downloads, it's got a really good social media um, platform to actually deliver a lot, down, a lot of downloads. So yeah, good uh, rating, 4.2 overall on the Play Store. And uh, we'll just jump right in. I just had a quick game. Okay, so you start off, there's an ad. Start off and obviously as the name suggests, Helix Jump. So you, you the character is this jumping ball and uh, it's got some cool graphics and the splat uh, uh, graphic there as it, as it bounces around, as you can see. So the name of the game is to get it down as many as you can and don't hit those orange parts here because that gets you out. Oh, and that's not very good. Okay, so graphic wise, very, very simple, minimalistic, and obviously, oh no. Um, the colors do change as you progress through. I'm having a shocker. I'm a lot better than this normally. I've played this a little bit. And uh, maybe it's the uh, stress of videoing as we go. Okay, so. So, I just noticed there, so we'll just quickly double check the no ad purchase, 369, about average, not the worst one I've seen, but not the cheapest either. So we can also go to coming soon feature in the middle, and we go to settings on the left. Why isn't anything happening? Oh, there it is. And then you got your sound function, restore purchases, and game center. For some reason my game center is not working today. Now, if that's a glitch, please let me know, but I think it was working previous. So they might be adding some skins to the ball maybe with that middle middle feature. So they're gonna be upgrading. And obviously if you can get multiple run-throughs through the different Helix areas, you get extra points. So the ads, like most, unfortunately, I'm sorry Voodoo, but with a lot of Voodoo games, there's a lot of ads. So I think um, some of the criticism or the not so good features are the fact that it can probably be a little bit repetitive. Now that's important for a good game hook and a good um, retention because people need to challenge themselves and get better at it. But probably with a little bit more interesting gameplay like that power up, then it would be better. Oh, and there was a moving platform then, or moving enemy. Moving enemy, did I say enemy? enemy? Oh, and I've just accidentally clicked on this right here. So the ads actually, in their defense, don't go very long, which is good. But uh, again, Voodoo are a little bit renowned for, you know, Probably, I'd say, oversaturation of ads. They're not the worst out there, but um, at least with this one, you've got the op option of actually clicking on it or not. Second chance. So that's probably one good way to get through. So, second chance. That game there was like one of the features in WordLink, so WordCross is a little, they've copied what WordLink did. Number one, number nine games in the world there. Hmm. Okay. So please comment what you think of this game, how far you've gotten. What's my best score so far? 18, is it? No, can't be 
Alright, that's more than that. Oh, my best is 415. There you go. Probably not that good, I don't think. I just missed that green one. Yeah, it's a very, very basic game. <laughs> it's, it's amazing it's really number one, to be honest, but simple games like this, this is actually a little bit groundbreaking in the sense that it was a totally unique gameplay style. Which is probably why they've gotten so many downloads. Oh, and I've pressed the ad again. So the ads are starting to get a bit annoying. The power-up's cool, I like that. I don't know if it's something that I'll be playing a lot of. But it is definitely, it hooks you in. It's a little bit addictive. And, and pretty unique. So I'm just going to hit a second chance ad here. See, what happens. See how long they go for. How long is it going to go for? This could be a 30 second ad. Just waiting, waiting, waiting. So you're looking around a 30 second ad here if, if you want to just keep progressing through the game. A lot of gamers probably do it. I want to reach that high score. I want to see what the high scores are. But my game center's not working. It's not the first time. I'm in love with the shape of you. We push and pull like a magnet. Kitty, kitty, baby, get at things for us. Okay, so game center is it working yet? Post your high scores, please. I want to see what people are getting. If you've beaten 415, I think mine was, let me know. Anyway, thank you for watching. If you've downloaded the game, please comment. Tell me what your high score is. Go and check it out. It's a pretty popular game. I hope you enjoyed the review, and uh, I'll see you next time. Okay, bye for now.